Day. Check it out. Just stunning. Blue skies. It's unreal. Um, so I went early the other night with the with the missus. She caught one eel. We were gonna do um a little segment of how to take the slime off them, but the cameras all went flat because it was so cold. So I went back out last night, um, managed to get another one. So I'll, uh, I hung it in the tree. Now I'm back to, um, yeah, show you how to get the slime off them. And uh, I'll do a little cook up as well. So here we go, here it is over here. The easiest way to kill these when you catch them is just stab them just behind the head there. I don't know if you can see that because the sun's in the way, but you stab them just behind the head and break the spine away from the head and the rest of the body. It just dies, they just die instantly. And then just hang it up, cut the tip of the tail off so that all the blood drains out, 
and just hang it overnight. It's really sweet. That's the best way I've found anyway. Saves, saves all the uh, bashing and thrashing and whatever. But yeah. So we'll get that going, and once that all burns down, I'll show you how to take the slime off the eel. So we'll just wait a while and, yeah, get into it. So our water's hot enough now. What I'm gonna do to get the slime off this thing is just dip it in there and the slime turns like a bluey gray color. It's um, yeah, and then just scrape it off. You can either use a knife, whatever, just a flat, something flat. See it's gone. It's gone like a grey colour. Then you just scrape it off. I found the best thing is just a an old credit card or something. That way it's not sharp and you won't cut cut into the meat. Look at that slime.
And then just dip it in there again. Leave it in there for a second. As you can see there's not much grey on there anymore. So most of the slime's almost off it. Just do the front bit again. Hold in there for a second or two. slime. Yuck. It's all there. There you have it. No more slime. Ready to, ready to cook. Easy to handle, don't get all slimy hands. Sweet. What I'm going to do now is get it ready for the smoker. So I'll just cut it in half. And what you want to do is go down the side of the backbone there. Cut that little bit of that little bit of blood there out. And same on that side. Down the spine there, down the tail front. Just open it up. If you wanted to get that bone out there, just go back down the other side.
do is season it. Some brown sugar and salt. Should be beautiful. I'm just gonna lay it in here. Salt. Just cover it with salt. And your brown sugar. Just like that, and then I'll leave that to marinate for a few hours. It's usually best to let the marinade ride for you know for a whole night. Get that flavour right in there, but I'll just do it for a few hours this one because uh, tomorrow I'm heading out sea fishing. Should be fun. But I'll let I'll let that sit and uh, yeah, we'll get it in the smoker. Okay, so the eel's been marinating for a few hours now. Um, just got the smoker ready so I'll go and chuck it in there and the smoke probably take about half an hour and um, yeah ready to eat should be good I'll just show you what it looks like see where the sugar and salts all dissolved into a liquid usually leave it in the fridge overnight it tastes way better and this, the flavor gets right through it so um yeah, we'll chuck it in the smoker and get it cooking. Here we go, should be done by now. So good. Damn. That's my dinner for tonight. Beauty.